We all know that Jupiter is the largest planet in our solar system. It's 318 times massive than Earth. And if you combine all the other planets, Jupiter would still be 2.5 times massive than this combination. With no solid surface, Jupiter is truly a colossal gas giant, just filled with hydrogen, helium, and other gases. But have you ever wondered how Jupiter saved mankind on Earth? What would have happened to Earth if Jupiter just disappeared? If you're curious about this, then stick with us till the end of the video. Hello and welcome to Astrophy's weekly show, and today we will learn the role of Jupiter in saving our planet Earth. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button first. Our solar system began as a disk of dust about 4.6 billion years ago. The first planets that formed were Jupiter, Neptune, Uranus, and Saturn. Jupiter took its shape about 4.5 billion years ago by pulling in massive amounts of dust and gas particles. Jupiter is the first planet that formed around our solar system. Jupiter is made from 90% hydrogen and 10% helium. Some astronauts refer to Jupiter as a failed star, due to its star-like composition. The only thing Jupiter didn't have to be a star was mass. We have a different video about why Jupiter is called a failed star. Go check out the link in the description box below. Jupiter doesn't have a true surface and is completely made of gas. However, astronomers suspect that due to immense gravity and pressure, the gas might have been compressed into a solid in the core. You might think, how does a ball of gas floating in space stay together and form a planet? Well, the credit goes to Jupiter's magnetosphere. The powerful magnetosphere deflects solar and cosmic rays, keeping the planet together. As Jupiter is massive, it's worth mentioning that we should be thankful to Jupiter's giant size and magnetic field that it generates, because it's possible that at some point, Jupiter may have saved Earth from being doomed. You know how dinosaurs got wiped out from Earth due to asteroid impact? Well, asteroid impact was not the only reason. The chain volcanoes, earthquake, and tsunami caused by asteroids played a major role as well. Earth gets hit by meteors and asteroids quite often, but they're all quite a small size and don't cause any harm. But asteroids the size that killed dinosaurs are quite rare, estimated to hit Earth every 500,000 years. This is where Jupiter might help us. Due to its immense gravitational force, it attracts bigger asteroids and shelters inner solar systems from any collision. In 1994, Comet Shoemaker-Levy, about half the size that wiped out dinosaurs, hit Jupiter. Astronomers believe that the comet was about 1.5 to 2 kilometers wide. However, the powerful magnetic field of Jupiter broke the comet into more than 20 pieces. The energy released by the collision was estimated to be equivalent to 6 million megatons of TNT, or 600 times the entire amount of TNT that human beings have created over their history. The collision created a huge dark spot about the size of Earth and heated up Jupiter's atmosphere to as hot as 30,000 to 40,000 degrees Celsius. To put that into perspective, atmospheric temperature of the Sun is about 6,000 degrees Celsius. If this comet were to hit Earth, then we might not be watching this video today. The results would be devastating, as the impact would send dust and debris into the atmosphere blocking sunlight from Earth. Some scientists say that these types of events are inevitable, given the number of objects that are floating around in space and Jupiter's massive gravity enveloping anything that gets close. We could say that Jupiter is like Earth's big brother, providing us shelter from outer comets and asteroids. We have learned new things about Jupiter and found out how the atmosphere are made up. We've also been able to image the planet and create highest resolution image of Jupiter, and we're constantly learning new things about it every day. When you look at Jupiter from the Hubble telescope, what you see is the sunlight reflecting off of Jupiter's atmosphere. With these amazing images, we are learning more and more about Jupiter every day. The best part is, we're not done yet. Juno spacecraft is still on its mission and has only completed one third of its planned mission. We'll leave this for the next video. Loving Astrophy? Why not subscribe to our channel and download our app from the Play Store? If you're keen about astronomy, then our app will definitely help you out. Check the link below to find out more. This video was made possible by people like you. Your feedback is what drives us to create more amazing videos like this. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to share it with your friends. We'll see you next week in our new episode. Until then, goodbye.